Today, I'll be reviewing the pinch block by Fictitious Climbing. And here we go. Immediately, you notice it comes with a black cord, which is relatively long, which is long enough to tie any applicable knot that you want to tie with, which is cool. Uh, you know, it's a pinch block because it says pinch and it's by Fictitious, which is a nice, slightly, uh, you can kind of feel the Fictitious and the Fictitious carved in, which is nice. Same thing in the pinch block, but not so much this logo part right here for whatever reason. Uh, I will say this center hole that has been cut is a bit not as good as I would like it to be or in terms of quality doesn't match the rest of the wood block simply because it is a little bit chipped it's not as smooth on the inside and it'd be nicer if these were slightly sanded to have more softer edge just like right here has a little softer edge and the same could be said about the opposite uh, circle that's been drilled so if all of this was quality, the one thing that's not quality is this drilled hold right here, which is a bit of a shame. Uh, in terms of the grips on this, we have the first pinch right here, which you hold it sideways. And from here, the weight will pull you down. You turn it around. And now it's a harder pinch where the friction is not with you in this case, which is two. You got three. You got four. And you have five now with these five pinches i think that's more than enough this end cut pinch right here does feel really good on all your fingers and you really want to crank your crushing strength um the wood quality in terms of the smooth textureness the top parts and all around the pinch right here in this plane feels really good to hold feels nice sanded feels durable on these sides right here this side and this side uh, it's not so smooth. You could feel the graininess of the wood, but I guess just, just the way they cut it and the way they finished it, it would be nicer if this was slightly more smooth though, honestly. Uh, all the edges are semi-rounded, which feels good on the hands. And it has a really nice weight to it. So you know it's really made of good hard wood. So that's a good thing. Uh, let's quickly test it out. Right now, I simply have 10 pounds on the loading pin. I'm going with the first off most obvious grip that you would use. That feels really good. I get good thumb activation going on here. So that's a good pinch. Let me try this one. That also feels relatively good. Nice. Now let's try the widest pinch. My hands are a little bit smaller, but oh yeah, that works. That's the pinch for you. Let me flip it around on this side. Grip it. Hmm. Okay. Well, I have noticed something because this wood right here is a little bit more grainy than this it does apply a little bit of friction when you pick it up so in those regards that could be seen as a good or bad thing just your preference but the little bit of graininess here does give you a little bit more grip as opposed to here let's try the small pinch that's a good pinch and let's just try the big pinch from the other side uh, a little bit easier to hold just because these things right here aren't exactly protruding in the sense that it's hitting your hand so if you're gonna hold this big one, I'll say hold it from this side. Um, yeah. In terms of uh, overall uh, impression on this bad boy, I think it's really well made. Has a nice little slight sloping to it. Has a nice enough variety of hand holes in terms of pitching for you to work. It's really durable. Again, the only actual downside is this inside circle that could be a little bit uh, betterly done. Um, and maybe this cordage, maybe there's like a axle that went through and had like uh, metal loops around it would be a little bit better of idea. But this string here works just as well. You just gotta make sure you tie the knots well, unless they might slip. That is something that I've heard before happening. So as long as you're good with your knot tying abilities and you're good. And you know, this little hole in the center could just fit any type of paracord cord type thing that's not too thick. Um, so yeah, and plus the cord they give you is long than enough for you to do whatever the heck you want with it. So. I would recommend you purchase one of these if you want to train your pinch strength. Yeah. We don't feel